It's 11 o'clock, and here's what's happening. It's Donald Trump's day in court. The former president of the United States pleads not guilty to 34 felony charges. Prosecutors say he orchestrated an unlawful scheme to influence the 2016 presidential election. These are felony crimes in New York State, no matter who you are. We cannot and will not normalize serious criminal conduct. Tonight, the former president is vigorously defending himself. For the first time since his arrest, he's speaking publicly. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. Today, we've seen something never before seen in the United States. A former president sitting in a courtroom charged with nearly three dozen crimes. We have team coverage of the arrest. Kerry Corrado has a closer look at the charges he is facing. But let's begin with Siafa Lewis as the former president spoke earlier tonight at his Mar-a-Lago estate. Siafa. Yuki, the 45th president of the United States, Donald John Trump, was placed under arrest and arraigned in his native New York City Tuesday afternoon. Trump faces 34 felony criminal charges of falsifying business records. The indictment against Trump says that he sought to undermine the integrity of the 2016 election through a hush money scheme with payments made to women who claimed they had extramarital affairs with Trump. On Tuesday night at his Mar-a-Lago estate in Florida, the former president addressed supporters and family members attacking President Biden, the district attorney in New York prosecuting this case against him, the judge in the case, Democrats as a whole, and the district attorney and special counsel investigating him in other cases. There was also this. And I never thought anything like this could happen in America. Never thought it could happen. The only crime that I have committed is to fearlessly defend our nation from those who seek to destroy it. With all of this being said, and with a very dark cloud over our beloved country, I have no doubt, nevertheless, that we will make America great again. Thank you very much. And God bless you. And God bless America. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. A very defiant former president and presidential candidate. The next in-person hearing date for Trump's case in New York is currently set for December 4th of this year. Just two months and a day before the Iowa caucus, the first Republican primary caucus of the 2024 presidential campaign. Siafa Lewis, CBS News, Philadelphia.